All right, so welcome back to SketchUp. Today, do you think you know where I am? Of course, I'm in the living room. So, do you know where I got all these stuff? The sofa, the table. Today, we're going to find out. So, in this video, we are going to do some rooms in the house. Over here, we have the bedroom, the kitchen, and the living room. So let's start off with a new one. Okay, so let's see how we're going to do the room. First, you get the rectangle tool and make a tiny bit of a square right here. Next, we are going to use the push and pull. Push it up, pull it up. And then we're going to use the rectangle tool again make a rectangle about this size and then push it in okay so after we made our room we are going to paint it so for the paint don't worry about a lot of stuff just use whatever kind of texture that you want maybe this for the house and then I'm just going to get some other texture for the floor. Okay, so if we go to the right side, we are going to see a lot of panels that we can click, but we want to use this one. It's fourth on the right, so one, two, three, four. And this is called the 3D Warehouse. Click that and you're going to see this window you can see a lot of 3D objects that you can download. But today we're going to look for a bed. Once we see this page, let's click Models. And then let's minimize the category. Now we can see the properties. For the properties, the file size that we're looking for is around 5 MB. Now you can change that to 10, but if your computer is slow, you can change that to 5. Now look for the bed that you want, and if you find it, and you're happy with it, click download. After a while, it's going to show up in your model and just put it somewhere that is you're happy with it. Now using the move tool you can move it around but if you look closely you're going to see four plus signs in red. So if you put your mouse over there you can see that it will have the protractor the green circle thing. When you click you can move it around in this axis you can also do this in this axis and on the top you can also do that on that axis so let's put it here so if you can see the bed is surrounded by these blue lines this means that the bed is in a group and the bed is an object right now. Our walls are not the same, but the bed is in a group. So after that, you can search for other stuff. Let's search for a computer. Again, models. Minimize the category. Make sure the file size is just about the right size then you can look for the computer that you want. Other models, such as this one, have many different kinds of model inside. So you can download that too. And then just put it there. And now we have our interior. And this one is a bedroom. You can try around and make your own room. 
you can make a bedroom, a living room, a kitchen, and many more. So that's how we can use the 3D Warehouse in SketchUp to make different kinds of rooms with different kinds of 3D models from other people. So until next time guys, keep on modeling and keep on doing great works. I'll see you in the next one. Bye bye!